Good day, everybody. Welcome to today's video. Today's video, we're going to look at this Innovation Multimeter and Oscilloscope 2-in-1 that was sent to me from banggood.com. I'm going to keep this one in my Jeep to take with me out on the trail. So I always have a tool to test electrical when I'm out there. The oscilloscope function is going to be pretty neat. Let's get everything out of the box here. We got a temperature probe, our leads, and user manual. Comes in a bag. I've already put batteries in it. Oh yeah, these ones have the protective on the tips, and this is the temperature probe. Let's get this out of the package. Just gonna quickly try out the temperature probe. You can get your readings in both Celsius and Fahrenheit just by pressing F1 or F2. So when you look at the meter, you got DC in red, AC in red, that's to use the oscilloscope. Now I'm going to be honest with you, I'm not exactly sure how to properly set one up, so I won't be able to show you, but you can see all the different functions, maximum 10 amp, you can use that to measure your current milliamps. I am not sure what HFE is, and of course your temperature. Next one is to measure your resistance. And then the last one is your volts. And then it's nice and convenient that there's an off button on the opposite side as well. This is not going to be a very good example of the oscilloscope, but it's going to be the best I can do right now until I can use it for real. I'm going to use this DC power supply. And since it is a constant power, all you're going to see is that line go up as I increase the voltage now if it was switching it would create like a, a pattern but since I'm just moving it up and down and it's not actually being triggered you can kind of get an idea how it goes so if you know what a a good a good wave pattern is or good wave form you'd be able to tell whatever your testing is good or not but if you want to go to the volts you just have to switch it all the way to that side there. Gets it all the oscilloscope. Then you gotta change your lead to go down in there. And of course, nice and bright so you can see it easy. So now the resistance part. You just got to turn it up one notch to right there. It says OL. So I'm just going to take my leads, for example, touch them together. And then zero them out. Perfect, just like that. Now one thing you do gotta watch out with this thing is that there's no soft protective cover. So if you drop it, you'll probably break it. it. Does take three, does take three AA batteries. It's not very expensive either. So I'm not too worried about it rolling around in the back of my Jeep. So right here, I'm just measuring some voltage across some fuses, nothing too serious, just kind of give you a quick Unboxing, look at the multimeter of some of its most basic functions. And then once I actually start doing some diagnostic videos where I'll need it, I'll most likely pull it out and try it out, especially the oscilloscope function. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or comments, post them below. And I'll see you in the next one.